we are out here on the Lucky Strike property and we're near a new massive calcopyrite showing that we found about a month ago, a month and a half ago. And we're about 100 meters down the road and we found this area here, which is very interesting. You can see all the oxidation all, all over the rocks. This almost looks like a overburden layer, but this is actually just deteriorated bedrock. Uh, very fractured. And all this black rock here, all up in here, and all over there, going up here and across there, is all magnetic. And I just hammered a few samples that I pulled from here. It's very fine-grained silicous rock, but you have pyrotite and calcopyrite, and it looks like it's mainly in the rock fractures. Some pyrite in there too. Extremely dense rock. We're going to poke around here for a little bit, take a sample from here as well. You can see just how fractured this is. See how dark this is. It almost looks like that surface shale, but it's not. We're at an area of heavy oxidation. This zone stretches for about a kilometer on this road. All the rocks are like this. And varying mineralization, sometimes no mineralization where the rock's silicous, but it still looks like this. Just pulled a sample from up there. And as you can see, There is disseminated iron pyrite. Coarse iron pyrite. Mineralization in this area over the kilometer stretch of road varies from about 1% mineralization up to 20%. And occasionally you get chunks like this, which is mostly iron sulfides up in here. 
other sample. Just on the road in another area here. Hammered off a piece of bedrock right here. Pyrite and calcopyrite stringers.